Jurors heard emotional testimony from the mother of a 13 year old girl who was kidnapped and murdered. Prosecutors say Darius Fields ordered Siobhan Randall's kidnapping in retaliation for stolen drugs the young victim had nothing to do with. Fields is on trial charged with organized criminal activity as it was related to the kidnapping and that led to an eventual murder. Fox Forest Lynn Ann Wynn was in court today and brings us the latest from there. Lynn Ann. Steve Siobhan's mother's testimony today was short but emotional. Some family members having to leave the courtroom as she broke down in tears on the witness stand. I don't know. I didn't know what to do, y'all. I didn't. It was like, get there. We just got to get there. Shaquana Persley in tears as she recounted the moment she found out her daughter, 13 year old Siobhan Randall, was missing. It was the summer of 2017. Persley says her daughter was at her aunt's house in Lancaster, where she usually stayed during the school year. She says she had three missed calls from Siobhan that morning, but when she called back, it went straight to voicemail. Then Siobhan's aunt called her with the news Siobhan was gone. It was like my mind was just all over the place. I was trying to get a ride at that point. It was like, we got to go. Where were you going? I was on my way to Lancaster. We was finna have to do what we had to do to find my baby. Police later found Siobhan's body inside an abandoned drug house in Dallas. She had been shot multiple times. Jurors also heard from a jailhouse informant who was in custody with the defendant, Darius Fields, and described a conversation he took as Fields admitting to his involvement. Well, he said that uh, he got robbed for the marijuana, that they knew who he was and they knew how he got down and they didn't want to listen, so he had to do the little Gene Molina is serving a 21 year sentence on drug charges and previously had his sentence reduced for cooperating with federal authorities. But prosecutors say he hasn't been promised anything for Monday's testimony. Defense attorneys noted it wasn't exactly clear what Fields said he did. Did he tell you he kidnapped him? Uh, no, he didn't tell me that. Did he tell you what he did to him? No, I mean... Molina also told jurors Field seemed to be gloating about what he did and didn't appear to be worried. And my son was around the age of the little girl, so, you know, you get to thinking, what if that was your kid, you know? And the prosecution has rested their case. The defense will get a chance to present their case starting tomorrow morning. We're told Fields is not expected to testify in his defense.